Oh, so it's the day to get the uh, permanent fix. So uh, goodbye temps, I've loved them. I'm gonna just have a few minutes chill, then head off downstairs, get a bite to eat, and then, yeah, final stages, and see what the turn out like. Hope I can still have little contour in a little gap. Maybe I'm just being weird. But yeah. Leave me to chill for a few minutes then. And I'll head off down for breakfast. But for now, go lay, go lay. Dead excited. Here we go then. Let's get them fixed. Woo! Galay galay. We run in the steel every time. So um with me being a bit deaf, I've obviously misunderstood what they said. I was going to actually get my imprints um for my pen. So pens are actually happening on Thursday, so the driver has kindly dropped me off. At a shopping mall. Hopefully, I can get a Liverpool share. See how that goes along. And uh, so, yeah, I'm still absolutely buzzing. And again, thank you so much for watching uh, my video diaries. And um, I just can't wait for them to be in. But um, they showed me the shades. Oh my God, there was Ral and White. I was like, absolutely not. And um, so, um, I said I want more natural and everything. Asked him to still keep some of the contouring of the uh, the gaps and everything. Daria, as um, the interpreter, has been absolutely incredible in supporting me, making sure I get what I want. Uh, she said if I went down just a little bit less on the colour that I wanted, uh, they could actually colour them in. So that was really, really, really good. I really found that uh, to be really, really good. Uh, the implants, uh, not implants, the impressions uh, that they did. Um, there wasn't happy, so normally it's like one up, one down. I had to go through three, oh, balking. Uh, but he kept saying, sorry, bless him. Uh, but yeah, the, the doctor was absolutely brilliant. Forgive me, I've forgotten his name. But my driver, driver is amazing. Name's Emmerich. Uh, no, not Emmerich. His name's Emmett. Uh, he doesn't know a bit of English, so I'm having to use his phone to Google Translate. <laughs> Oh, it's, it's just been absolutely brilliant. Uh, so yeah, offer a go for a little bit of retail therapy now. And grab maybe a cocktail, uh, so I'm allowed to drink. Woo! <laughs> but for now, go lay, go lay. This is Shopper's Paradise, literally, loads of little shops and everything. Some perks. Yeah, something for everyone here. It's brilliant. Love it. Love a bit of culture, mate. For now, see you soon. So I've just I got my ass off literally at the old bazaar and got myself two Liverpool shirts, a uh, couple of pairs of shorts, a nice uh, polo and yeah a couple of shirts as well. Uh, actually quite pleased with it. Uh, I did try to get lower but I won't get my own wear so but I really wanted them so if you want something get it. But yeah let's do a bit more shopping and hopefully I'm not going to be absolutely skint. Uh, but for now Legola.
absolutely stunning. Absolutely love it here. Yeah. Coming as a solo traveller, Antali Turkey, walking round. Can't say I feel safe because obviously that's not the right thing to say. But do I feel comfortable? Oh, flipping hell, I do. Brilliant. People around here are just absolutely fantastic. Really company. Oh, that's a word. So, yeah, that little boat there. It's a real cute little boat. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to leave you for now, but for Gale Gale. So I've just put myself a little tour um, on about 45 minutes to go see some waterfalls. I'll see you soon. So now I'm on board. Nice little duty boat. Let's go see some, a little waterfall. Some ruins? I believe so, anyhow. Didn't even look quite well. Just sounded interesting and cheap. Just jumped on. Yeah, a bad gale gale. And it's just leaving the beer now. And it's gonna be spectacular. Great way to end the day. And yeah, hopefully, see some history, a couple of waterfalls. I don't know what to expect. Just some pretty cheap and cheerful. And uh, yeah, it's beautiful as well, that's really shiny. So yeah, let's take a look at the camera. to eat now a nice mocha wow nice one bring it on baby So guys, I walked all the way back from the shopping trip, all the way back to the hotel. It's something like 10 miles, something like that. About 22,000 steps, I think it were. Oh, it was beautiful walking down, um, absolutely gorgeous. If you come to Antalya, walk back if you're staying at the resorts on Cognete Beach, or what they call it. Um, yeah, it's amazing. So yeah, let's show you what I <laughs> bought from Knockoff Nigel in the, um, in the actual stores um so yeah they are able to haggle let's have a look but first of all i got um my mum, my little sister big sister and um, obviously we've got our magnet and also one for maddie the weirdo at scarborough she likes her she likes her magnets don't you maddie then i got myself some lovely swim shorts from hugo boss and yeah they're all right actually yeah and then I also got myself some Nike joggy pants. Let's have a look what these look like. Yeah, definitely says Nike. Football.com. Definitely. Oh, look at the rail. 
Uh, they've been signing from the second and pair, haven't they? From knockoff Nigels. The next, I got myself a nice green Adidas top. Yeah. Got the same in blue as well. I can guarantee you though, this vinyl will definitely rip out. I have to get our Joanna to put some new ones on when it rubs off. Yeah, a blue and a green one. And then what I came to take you for, because I refused to pay the prices in England. I got myself, uh, I was about to say WWE then, um, uh, Liverpool shirt, lovely. And guess who's on the back? It's Salah. They know how to spell it, that's good. <laughs> and then I got the away kit as well. Ooh yeah. And guess who's on the back? Salah. Oh, is that the right name? Of course it is. Dickhead. Huh. Yeah. So yeah. And then to finish it off, got myself a lovely polo shirt. And it's actually really good quality. And it's uh, Ralph Lauren, or Ralph Lorenzo probably. Uh, but yeah, all that lot paid 60 quid. Uh, she wanted a lot, lot more than that to be fair. Uh, but yeah, great little shopping trip. I'm really glad that uh, I did it. And like I say, it was just really random because I was only there for two hours, obviously, because I thought I was actually getting the actual thing done. Um, the actual individual, shall I say. Um, but yeah. Thanks to my lovely driver, uh, em, em, Emma. Emma Ritt. Thanks to my lovely driver who took me to Antalya, told me to stay in the um, in the actual mall. But <sighs> been to Tunisia, I've been to Egypt, can't be any worse than there. I tell you what. Um, obviously, I can't say if I feel safe, I said it earlier, but I felt really comfortable. Really, really glad that I did it and that random boat trip as well. Really hit the, the, the nail on the head. It was absolutely brilliant. And then walking back, oh wow, yeah. I'll be a burnt sausage tomorrow. Don't know if you can see the manures is caught, but yeah, thank you for watching uh, another one of my vlogs. I really appreciate your time. Um, yeah, you can get a little bit of information, I suppose. Um, but yeah, Thursday can't come quick enough. That'd be time for my teeth, so no more temps. I tell you what, it was bloody hot when they took these out and uh, put the um, impression in. Um, only like saw dull ache, but bloody hell. I've got real sensitive teeth as it is. Uh, but yeah, still smiling, still buzzing. I won't cry, I promise. Not this time. I was just emotional the other day. Silly cow, aren't I? The last war again. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so thank you for watching Adventures of the Mullies. My name's Tommy, but for now, go lay, go lay.